I think I can see. Uh, is this is this the corridor at the end? Is this he's still chasing me? Why oh, he's moving at me? He wants to get inside me. Too bad, buddy. I made it to safety. Oh! G'day, guys. My name's Josh. Yo, can't call me Zawoodle. And welcome to a little game called Rib Eye Charlie's. I'll come all out to the wall so you can see the logo. Rib Eye Charlie's will make you eat until it hurts. I it start there is no menu. It just starts off dunks you straight in to this weird like 90s looking diner with the sweet VCR effects going on and it has locked you in. The steel shutters have come down and I am locked in this haunting restaurant and now I have to find a way out. I need to find a way out. So I I, I don't know. Maybe maybe I got to find I go out through the roof, go out through a window, the back entrance. There is a secret trap door leading to a tunnel of pain. I don't Oh. oh. Hold the horses. What's this? Uh, Red White Charlie is working. Yeah, okay, three ninety nine. Give to the author. Give it to the authority. Delicious and re refreshing. I thought it said respectful. And I was like, no, it's not. Um. Oh, Red White kill them. Okay, someone's um. Listen, my parents gonna leave that one there. Uh, interesting. Okay. Uh, some blood in. No, it's just are they? Uh, it's just the effect of the VCR. This VCR effect is cool, but it makes it kind of hard to see what's going on. Uh, okay, there's a door in the corner. So I don't actually know what this game's really got in store for me. Other than a locked door, apparently. Uh, apparently it's supposed to be a spooky horror game. We all know how much I love spooky horror games and that I absolutely freaking don't. So this could go really bad for me or... I can take the menus and I can put the menus back. Okay, well I'll take... Can I like... Wait, hang on. There was like, there was like $3.99 on this, yeah? Do I have to like find $3.99 somewhere? Can I take it out of the till? Can I can I rob the place to pay the place? Eh, I can't I can't break open the menu either. Well, what am I supposed to do then? I can't pick up any chairs to break the windows or anything. I mean, even if I could, it's not going to get me very far because there's steel bars on it and stuff. Look, I can take one of these and throw these through the window. Like, eh, wait, eh, eh there, no, eh, I can't. Ah, oh, okay, I couldn't do it because it's a, the prompt of need to find a way out was blocked me from throwing it, so I can't. What am, I, what am I supposed to do? Maybe I, I, it must have something to do with the red lights. There's like, there's no other red shimmering lights like there is on this. This is, this is unique all on, unto itself. I can't jump. Um, there's nothing hanging around. It's alright. It's alright. I found a key. Does key unlock the front door? Can I, is that, is that all there is? Was, it, was I supposed to set a trap for me? Find a way out. Nope, can't do that way. Maybe the key unlocks this door. I don't know, rib, rib, rib white. I mean, you've got a great stash on you, mate, and you've got a nice little belly, but like you could have, you could have not lost being in your restaurant with no one, you know? Okay. Oh, okay. Progress. We have a door open. Bunch of barrels. Bunch of thing. Are that is they? Are they people? Oh, what is that? What is this? No, no. I take it back. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm leaving. Okay, you don't follow me into the into the corridor apparently. What the fuck was that? It had glowing red eyes, so clearly it was evil. What? The, there's a there's a couple of them. There's one down the end of the hallway as well. Anyway, what I was saying is these look, these look like cocooned, cocooned humans. Like you know, got the ankle up there, the knee, and like the body. Or they're either that, or they're just like legs of cow. I don't fuse box. Wait, I keep I keep hearing things I don't want to hear. Okay, fuse box. How do I? So, so, oh, okay. I'm gonna need to find fuses. Of course I need to find fuses. You always gotta find fucking fuses in these kinds of games. Okay, let's be brave and just go exploring a little bit. Oh. Did he see me? I don't know. Can I just, just like sneak in here? Can I close the door? I can't close doors. Okay, that's gonna be a problem. Someone's gonna come in here and butt fuck me. Hey, look, a fuse. How do I know I have to find fuses? Okay, I have a fuse. Can I, can I, can I get out? Okay, he's down there. That's okay. Let's go around the back, get back to the fuse box, put the fuse in. Just a little bit of progress is better than no progress. Because this then I'm back near the front door so I can get out and escape if someone starts chasing me again. Oh, okay. So far, so good. Oh, it's a fucking person with a cow head. What the fuck? What the fuck are you, Jeffrey? You like those, you know how people wear like the like the floppy horse heads these days? Oh, there's another one coming. Okay, they're, they're, all, they're all pretty mad. Yeah, you know how people have like the like the floppy horse heads and pretend that they're horses? These guys are wearing like cow heads. What is that noise? What keeps, is it the barrels? I, or is that like, is that like a hit to where the next fuse is? I don't know, I don't wanna go that way though. There's a guy right there. 
Okay, this sneaky deaky. Sneaky deaky. Just like to get in. In. Are we okay? I can't close the door. There's a bunch of papers on the ground and no no fuse. I'm here for fuses. I ain't here for litter. Okay, if I just tail this guy. Oh. 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 Oh, okay. It's all right. We're okay. That wasn't a cow with Jeffrey, but I'm not going to go that way because I feel like that guy might alert these guys to my presence and suddenly, oh, we're wearing a cow's head. No, 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 no. He's real close. I can't sprint. There's no sprint. I, I got, okay. I'm sorry. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, the safety of the barley corridor. You can't touch me when I get to here. Okay, you go that way. Oh, damn it. Where do you guys keep coming from? You big moo moo fox. Would you leave me the balls alone? Go stick your horns in someone else, you big beefy bitches. Another door. Okay, in, in. Any fuse? No fuse. Okay, damn it. I just... I need to find... Where the hell am I supposed to be going? I don't... Oh, okay. There's a new part. Of, this is a diff different kind of corridor. This is like a labyrinth. I don't like this part at all. Okay, another door. Just sneak in the door. There we go. Where the fuck am I? And where the balls are all the other fuses? Okay, I'm going this way. Please don't walk around the corner. The blind corners. Oh, that's another fuse. Yes. Okay. Fuse. Fuse. Got the fuse. Need, uh, I assume there's four fuses. These games always have four fuses. Oh, can I please just leave? Can I please just take my ball and go home? I don't want to play this game anymore. It's very dark. It, was it always this dark? I don't know. If I get caught in here, though, I'm completely screwed because there is no way out. Oh. Oh, okay, he's coming for me, and I'm a million miles away from safety corridor. Gotta go. Gotta go, yo! I think I can see. Uh, is this is this the corridor at the end? Is this, He's still chasing me. Oh, no! oh, he's mooing at me. He wants to get inside me. Too bad, buddy. I made it to safety. Oh! oh, I didn't make the safety corridor. It was right there. <laughs> I scream like a man. What are you talking about? Oh, those glowing red eyes. That sent a shiver through me. Okay, put the fuse in. There we go. Uh, wait, maybe, maybe I should check... Uh, the front door. Then I'll put a couple of fuses in. Maybe I should, um... Nah, it's still all... It's still all locked up. Alright, never mind. I guess we have to keep trying our luck with the Moo Moo Fox! Oh, I get what those, those, like, pinging noises are. That's not like telling me where the fuses are. It's telling me where the cows are. They've got cow bells on. Oh, shit! Fuck! Okay. Uh, he's right behind me. That's alright. We all run at the same speed. It's like AFL Evolution. There is no speed differences between people. As long as you're running in the right direction, you're A-OK. -okay. Oh, okay. Where the hell is this other fuse going to be? This is really freaking hard. What the hell is this? Ribeye Charlie is... ...transmitted at the request of the authority. The authority emergency management agency has issued a civil danger warning for all locations within our broadcast area. Effective 9.57pm local time. Oh. All residents are advised to shelter in place. I saw some red glowiness. Stay inside. Close doors and windows. Turn off air conditioning or heating systems and monitor radio or TV for more information. This message was transmitted at the request of the authority. Okay, so that's, that's a sort of loop. So apparently, shit has gone down, and I should have been uh, take, taking shelter in place, but instead, I'm running around a freaking meat market, trying to find fuses for a fuse box, and avoid some cowie Jeffs. Okay, I've, I found a fuse in front of the TV. Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck! Okay, okay. Uh, emergency plan time. Emergency plan. Maybe I can, maybe I can duke him. Can I duke him? Oh, hop! Duke him! No! No! I'm back to the start! I had three fuses! Oh, just let me out, you big sacks of shit! Okay, thankfully all the fuses seem to stay in the same place. So once I find them, I'm alright. So I've got two... I just need to get that third one from in front of the TV, uh, and then I can go back to the fuse box and plug it all in and be uh, ho home and hosed. Happy as Larry, I can leave this scary ass. Don't, don't see me. Oh, okay, I snuck in. We're okay. Yes, okay, I get it. But the problem is that there is definitely someone hanging out outside the little corridor down there, and I don't want to deal with that shit. Oh, no. No, I had it. I had it. I was right there. And then it came around the corner at the last second. I was tailing one down in the fuse box. And just when I at least needed at least one of them showed up around the corner. That was not okay. Is there only two? Maybe there's only two of these Jeffreys running around. I think I've only ever seen two at a time. 
Okay, just turn the corner. Blind hope. Blind hope. Yeah, baby. Okay, not going for the fuse box just yet. Got straight to the safety corridor and taking some time to catch my breath. Oh, shit, because those cows are still coming for me. Fuck off. God, go like chew on your cunt in one of your several stomachs and get the fuck out of my face. Okay, we've just got one fuse remaining. I have no idea where it could be. Maybe it's over like at the big fat dude at the back down there. Maybe... I mean, that's, I, oh, come on, get your glowy eyes out of my dick, and fuck off for three seconds. So, the only, I saw that big fat dude sitting on the ledge before, and I pissed myself and ran away. So, maybe that's where I need to go. Maybe, maybe that's where, the, maybe that's where the next fuse is. I just need one more. I'm so close, I can taste the fresh air of freedom. I just need that last fucking fuse. Oh, buddy, yes, you do have it. I'll take that. Thank you very much. Okay, I've got the last fuse. I'm going for it. Please, no cow. No whammy, no whammy, no beefy, no beefy, no beefy. Going straight for the eggs. Okay, fuck it. Boom. Four fuses in. Fuck you, cow. Don't give a fuck. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm going. Catch a freaking later. Oh, yeah. Thank God. Oh, they, no, they don't follow me out here. Okay, we're good. We're good. You escaped. Thank you for playing. Oh god, that for just a shitty little flash game that could like, you could beat in about five minutes. That got me so hard. That cooked me. Holy shit. I'm actually pretty proud of myself, if I'm honest. I, I mean, I only died that one time. I managed to make a pretty good effort of avoiding getting gored by the big horns of fuck off, Phil, by those cowie Jeffs. I mean, they, they came for me a lot, but I managed to find my little safety hallway, and I was A-OK. -okay. So I actually got through it pretty unscathed. Uh, I mean, I don't do horror games very much, but I played this one, and I fucking dominated this one. So that's like a little, that's like a little chip on my shoulder, a little badge that I'm going to wear for the rest of my life. But... I'll have to come back and play some more indie games in another episode because this episode is done. So thank you guys for watching. Most of all, thank you to all the patrons on Patreon who made this episode possible. If you like to make sure the like button down below and subscribe to this channel, follow me on Twitter. If I don't talk to you there first, I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.